Hey guys, uh, so in this video I'll be talking about the Zettles, which are the notes that make up the Zettelkasten system. And uh, these are the notes that are the foundation of the whole thing. So uh, they will in large part determine the usefulness of your Zettelkasten system. Uh, so I think it makes uh, good sense to get a good handle on uh, what makes uh, a Zettel. And if you want to dive deeper into it, there's a really good book called How to Take Smart Notes, uh, where you can learn much more about the Zettelkasten system generally. So the principles for the Zettels are that one, uh, it should be about one thing only, and uh, it should cover it in its entirety. Uh, if you uh, can't grasp what that thing uh, is about, then it's gonna be difficult to link it to uh, other notes. Uh, and uh, if, it's, um, if you need to um, you know, go back to the original text or if, uh, if it's fragmented, uh, that just makes uh, interlinking very difficult. Uh, the second thing is that it should be concise. Uh, remember that Zettels are uh, index cards and uh, it's quite easy to sort of lose, uh, forget that fact when, uh, when you're using a digital tool and you can just you know, copy and paste or write forever. Um, and uh, the reason why the Zettelkasten system is so useful is because uh, in the original form, when you're using index cards, you're forced to write very concisely and in your own words. The third thing is that it should be simple uh, and not uh, overly complex. Um, otherwise, it will be difficult to, uh, uh, to I guess, uh, when you're looking at the notes to immediately grasp what the idea is about. And that's gonna make it uh, difficult to link it to other notes again. Uh, and uh, it should also be concept uh, oriented. Um, the natural way uh, for taking notes might be to start a new note when you're starting another book or you're doing a project or you're watching something. Uh, whereas if you're trying to take notes and organize your notes by concepts, it uh, almost forces you to um, just see what the sort of big ideas are. And, uh, and it will be easier to link uh, notes together in this way. And uh, the final thing is that you should always try to link your notes together. Uh, the more linkages there are, the stronger the system is gonna be. And the more likely it is that you'll uh, encounter surprises. And uh, this is one of the biggest benefits of using this is that as you bring, uh, as you add more and more notes, um, you'll see sort of more and more uh, unexpected uh, ideas that uh, pop up. And, uh, and uh, so when you're adding these notes, uh, one thing is that uh, you should always be looking for ways to uh, link it to as many other notes as possible. So I hope you've enjoyed this one and uh, I'll see you in the next video.